back to the channel, y'all. In this video, we're gonna be trying out. I had these cereal for a while, you know. We're gonna be trying out the mashup Kellogg's Fruit Loops and Foster Flakes. Now they together here, as you guys can see. I had these a while. Let's now gonna try them out. Fruit Loops with Foster Flakes. I don't know how that combination gonna be, but it is what it is, you know. <laughs> Y'all know why I got them at. Got these at Walmart for three dollars and I think a three sixty eight. So um, I don't know how this combination gonna taste, man. But uh, that's the box right there. Mashup, Fruit Loops and Foster Fleets. All right, so uh, <laughs> let's get on and see what it tastes like. Is it a flock or what? Here we go. Good though. Hmm. Nice and fresh. Pretty good combination. Pretty good to me. Now the parts I don't like, it's like the Foster Flakes are getting more soggy here than the Fruit Loops. So, typical. <laughs> but other than that, they taste pretty good. Will I go out of the way to buy these again? Probably not. But they're good. Pretty good. Sweet, not very sweet. Fresh. Um pretty good all I can say is I mean you got fruit loops and foster flakes they're pretty good are they a good combination on a scale of one through five first taste I'll give it a three they're good but I think it tastes better by itself if it's Fruit Loop, eat Fruit Loops. If it's Foster Flakes, eat Foster Flakes. This combination together, I get this. It's all right. It's good, but I'm giving it a three. I prefer just the Fruit Loops alone and the Foster Flakes alone. Let's give my honest opinion. So anyway, there you have it, guys. For the mashup Kellogg's Fruit Loops plus Foster Flakes, I'm giving it a three out of a five. I prefer each alone. All right. Hit that subscribe button. Till next time. Three out of a five. And I'm out of here. Peace.